Golarimi Nation, my friends, Fight Club for Footballers, the place where we host our exclusive programs on speed, skill, strength, nutrition, mindset. On top of all that, we have exclusive interviews with players in the top five leagues and national team players. We also have exclusive guests from people who you definitely know with inside information on the best ways that you can improve as a player on and off the field. You also have discounts on Golarimi.com and stores like Unisport and all of that for $19. $99 a month. And because Valentine's Day was yesterday and we want to show the love, our yearly membership, 240 bucks, is now $99. For $99, you can get everything we just named for the entire year. Snap on that before it is too late, and we will see you guys later. On to the vid. My name is Willbot. AI has taken over. Five mistakes that pros don't make and how you can fix them. Let's go. Pros don't normally get caught with the ball, and do you know why that is? It's because they open their bodies up. Amateur players think that they have tons and tons of time. Well, you don't. What you need to do is make sure that you open your body up every time you receive the ball. At the very least, you need to make sure that you check before that, that way you don't get caught with the ball. You cannot just stand there and expect that you're gonna have all the time and space, especially when you're in front of goal. So make sure, very first point, open that body up. Statistics say you should wear 50% less sunglasses inside. And the reason for that is I'm a cyborg. Now, what you need to know about taking two touches is that all pros are always, always ready to do anything on the field in two touches. The majority of them. Why? Because the game is that fast. And if you want to be able to play and achieve things at that level, you have to always think, what can I do? How can I achieve what I want in two touches? Put that mentality in your head. That will change everything for you. Statistics were wrong. Now, the same thing applies when you are trying to take a shot. You've got to get things going, okay? You've got to be able to make sure that you can take this shot, if you can, in one touch. Anytime you can set yourself up to do something in one touch, you want to do it. Obviously, there's going to be a time and place for you guys to keep the ball. But now, specifically speaking, in front of goal, if you can strike this first time, if the ball is laid off perfectly, don't take two, take one, all right? The idea is that you guys have to get yourself in the mentality of doing the most simple thing as quick and as efficient as you possibly can. That's what will take you from being an amateur to a pro. Pros are efficient. Amateur guys think they have all the time in the world and all the space, and that's not efficient. Well, statistics inconclusive. Now, what you want to do as a player on the field is you want to be able to protect the ball if you are in trouble. Everything that I said was you have to be efficient. You have to make sure things happen too in one touch. For it. And you're thinking, Willbot, what happens when things don't go the way that I have planned them? I don't know. You don't freak out. No, you don't freak out. Guys, you protect the ball. The one thing that you always have for yourself is shield. If things go wrong, put your body in between the defender, the attacker, and the ball, and then cover up, all right? Be firm, be stiff, control the situation to the best of your ability. That's what will help you. Don't be afraid to be rough and tough. Defend your space, defend the ball. That's what will make you a baller. I haven't activated my Willbot extensions yet. Well, anyway, the thing is, is that after all the things that we've talked about today, one of the things that you could use very, very nicely is the ability to, of course, pretend. <laughs> pretend that things are going wrong and then really? Oh, you thought that I was taking three, four touches and then boom, I'm gone. I'm off, okay? That's the other thing that you can do with all of this. A bit of misdirection. So we said to solve things in two touch, one touch. Well, you guys have all seen Brazil play. You guys have all seen who Neymar is. You guys have all seen Ronaldinho. These guys take a ton of touches. What's happening there? Well, if you train your technique, if you train your improvisation, if you train your creativity, if you take tons and tons of touches, you can be in a position to think that you're gonna take two touches and then really one, two, three, bop, 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 step over and you're gone. Elevator out. <laughs> and that's the video. You know exactly what to do, my friends. Subscribe, like, comment. Tell us how much you would pay for a Willbot. Go check out Glory Nation because that, my friends, is Fight Club for Footballers. The greatest thing you could ever have as a footballer. We've got it for you. Link is right down below. We will see you guys later. Peace.
everyone could start somewhere. And long term, again, like if you want to go pro, you better master all four of those. There's no excuse not to. Just like a bodybuilder, you wouldn't expect to only bench and not do your other exercises. These guys who have, let's say, made it to the top of the top of, of world football, they, just like you said, have gone through all these bumps and stuff like that. And they also have had every opportunity to get off the, the train and get off the road. Yeah, and they yeah. didn't. They didn't give up and they kept going. And they realize while you, you talk to them, and I've seen this too, you realize that you see guys with possibly better potential, better technical ability, or better than you give up yeah. at a certain roadblock. And you're like, why is he giving up? Like, he's so, he's so good. And they're done. And, you, and then they keep going, right? Yeah. And so there's tons of people also who have made it just because they haven't given up, yeah. right? And because but, they had a little bit of, you know, but look it's at, crazy. Look at Ronaldo uh, or every, every other big player. They will point to two, three players in their youths that were significantly better than them. That's right, my friends. It is time for you to put in the work with a little bit of skill training. Today, we have one of the most important patterns in dribbling. Inside, outside, inside, outside, inside, outside. That's exactly what we will be doing. All of it with an entire aim of making our feet faster while coordinated, all right? There's no use in being fast if you guys are gonna screw it up. So make sure that you get the pattern down. How to train that? Yeah, let's break it down. I mean, the first thing to realize is that even if you go to trainers, no matter how fancy and authoritative they may make it seem, we're at the very beginning of strength training for sport. So some of the things, for example, to lift weights with your ankles, with your feet, this relates heavily to speed, but like the devices for this didn't even exist. So people can pretend all they want, but to get the best results, you're going to have to go into it with no ego and realize that we're only at the very we're now beginning the idea of actually lifting weights for sport, for speed. So right off the bat, you're talking anything speed related we're talking. You want to be doing your weight training from the ground up. So a simple example is like if someone walked into the gym and did 10 chin-ups with great form, you'd be like, oh, that's, you know, that's nice. It's a fit person. It wouldn't be shockingly impressive. Now, the amount who can do that and do 10 like perfect Nordic hamstring curl, you're just still lifting your body. But you're lifting your body now from your hamstring. And that's just one example. So to give you guys an essential idea of why this is so important for you as a footballer and as a young player or wherever it is uh, that you are, we have to figure out. Goal Ramey has done the work for you. Now you put in the work for us together.